Good morning, everyone. Here we are. It's Monday. I am headed into work to do a couple things, and then I'm leaving the office early to go and pick up some toothpaste for my dentist. I use a special toothpaste that you can't order online because fluoride is bad. Don't buy that nasty stuff in the grocery store. Um, so I'm out and I need to go pick that up and then I just need to do a few things, finish packing, and then I'm off to Louisville for the week for a work, a business trip. So, um, I'm not excited about going, but I am because I'm going to see, um, teammates that I have not seen in six years or meet some new teammates that I've never met. And then in addition to that, my nephew and his girlfriend live in Lexington and they're going to be relocating to Louisville for my nephew's job. So they're going to meet me in Louisville, um, while I'm there, um, to have breakfast with me because that's the only free slot I had available and then take me to the airport the day I leave. So, and then they're going there to scope out the area and see if they can find an apartment because they're going to be moving there. So. I'm really excited about seeing my nephew. Um, my nephew, when he was a baby, I um, basically helped raise him. My sister was a single mom, like she is now, and um, and so you know, I uh, he's like a kind of like a son to me, you know. But we're really close, so I can't wait to see him. I haven't seen him. Um, they were here this year, well, last year in Texas, they came to visit. So, um, but. Anytime you can get a business trip and sneak in a visit with some friends, that's awesome. And if any of you live near Louisville, my schedule's tight, but I can make something happen um, if you'd like to see me. It looks like, well, I don't even know if that'll work because I don't have a rental car. Uh, my other teammates are going to be driving me around because I have other teammates meeting me there. So, um, but if you want to come to me, if you live in Louisville and you want to come meet me, um, I'd love to do that. So let me know. Wednesday's the only night, Wednesday evening's the only night I have available right now though. So, um, what else? Well, tonight and Wednesday night I fly in and I don't have anything going on on Tuesday. I'm booked all day and all night. Wednesday day, um... Thursday day and night and then Friday morning I'm booked and then I leave so tight schedule but it'll do and I can't wait to come home to my husband if you saw um, if you're part of the Facebook group if you saw on Facebook this weekend we went shopping and got some um, stuff to get my nephew's room started this is the first time he's had his own room um, my sister got an apartment. She'd been living with a friend since she's been here, and he's a baby. He's going, well, he's going on two, but he's still a baby. So he um, has his own room in this new apartment, and so she said that I could decorate it because I always wanted to decorate a kid's room. So we're going to slowly put the pieces together so we don't break the bank. Um, you know, just get a few things here and there, and then it'll it'll become a adorable kids room. I want to get some wall decals. He has a bed, but I'm going to replace it to match the nightstand and the other furniture that I'm getting him. Um, I already got the nightstand. So, um, so this is fun and he loves his room. My sister said that they went out last night and they came back and he ran in the house and he ran down the hall to his room and he said, see, see, like he's so proud of his room. So that makes me very happy. Regarding HCG, I um, had a couple ups and downs this weekend. We went out to eat and a couple times, and I think just from sodium, my um, my weight, you know, went up like 1.2, and it went up 0.8, and then it went down today, 1.2. So right now I'm currently 0 0.80 below LDW. Um, which is good because I'm I wanted to start this business trip off below LDW. I wish I was even lower because I'm sh I'm going to be eating out a couple nights. However, I did get a room that has a kitchenette so that I can prepare my breakfast and my lunches and bring them with me. So, um, the couple dinners that I'll have out, you know, I'm just going to be really careful. Have steak or salad or you know, try to stay P2ish, um, except for quantity. 
And then um, I'm not bringing my scale because I'm bringing a carry-on luggage, hopefully, if I can fit everything in it. And I just don't want to be lugging a scale around. And it's making me a little nervous because it is P3. But, you know, I'm just going to have to trust that my body will do as it should. And that when I get back, it, um, you know, that I'll be within my two-pound range still or below LDW. Who knows, you know? So that is the plan. I am loving P3. Um, I've had lots of dairy, so cheese, faye, cream. Yesterday I had bacon and eggs and avocado. And um, so I've just really been enjoying it. When we went out to dinner, I had a, um, I had a steak and some other stuff. So anyway, I've been uh, enjoying it, staying within my range and loving life. So I am at work now. I need to run in. I'm vlogging and the girl next to me is putting makeup on in her car. She's probably like, what is she doing talking to herself? So um, I wanted to touch base with you guys because I probably won't be vlogging while I'm gone. I won't have my little gadget with me. I may if I have time in my room. Um, but if not, I will definitely be on the Facebook page and I will be in touch with everyone. Um, Hebby, congratulations on reaching your 100 pound mark. I can't wait to get there. I don't know when it's going to happen, but it will at some point. I'm not, I'm, uh, I'm still like seven or eight pounds away from that, so... Um, I think that's it. You girls have a beautiful week, day, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.